a performing art that goes deeper than just creating beautiful displays. Shen Yun's mission to revive the traditional values of ancient Chinese culture has inspired audiences around the globe. NTD Xu Wenrong has the story. I was surprised and touched halfway through. I mean, I'm almost in tears. For thousands of years, classical Chinese dance was used to express traditional values. Shen Yun shows those values through story-based dance. It really touches the heart. I think it really does. And I, I just can't believe, well, to me it's important that I think just everybody, everybody should experience this and, uh, should, uh, and should see the performance and actually feel the, um, uh, the energy uh, that, that comes from that. After the Chinese Communist Party took power, it systematically began to destroy ancient Chinese culture. Even today, the regime continues to persecute people of faith. When people are telling you you're wrong, when people are telling you that you uh, should be quiet, you should continue to speak up, you should continue to practice what you believe in, what makes you feel good. The audience felt enlightened after hearing that Shen Yun continues to revive those values by depicting stories of the current persecution of Falun Dafa, a spiritual discipline that focuses on meditation and moral improvement despite facing pressure from the regime. We live in times that we can't afford to deny what's going on in America, in China, in Europe, in Israel, in South America, wherever we are. We have to stand up and speak the truth. The audience said that Shen Yun has something that stands out from other performances. Leaving this performance, I feel extremely peaceful. I feel healed to an extent, um, to an extent in which I want to explore the practice further. Shen Yun artists follow an ancient Chinese tradition. They believe that cultivating the heart is the way to create art that is beautifully sublime. You'll come for the art, for the colors, for the movements, and you will leave inspired by humanity. Reporting by Xu Wenrong, NTD News.